Week 3 IB, IPBL match versus Sableye and the Miami Dolphin Dolphinis. So we're going to get going here. This is the team we're bringing. Uh, you should definitely go check out the team prep if you did not. Uh, so you know why I'm bringing what I'm bringing. Um, I'm a bit nervous. So I ended up changing. I will have put it in the team prep uh, that I ended up changing my... The Electros, it's the same Electros that I brought last week, actually, because of the different... Because I only had the one special move rather than the two this time, so I decided rather than making them more different, I just put a lot in attack. So here's the team he brought. He brought Flygon, Thunderous Eye, Tapu Bulu, uh, Mandibuzz, Porygon 2, and Moira. Right. Now, immediately... I actually really like an Escalator's lead. Or Azura. It's gonna be one of the two. Escalator's or Azura. Azura doesn't have Pivot, which is unfortunate, but Escalators just it does match up kind of well. He doesn't bring the Cresselia, so that's a huge weight off my shoulders. I didn't bring the Melotic. I think I really like Escalators. I think I want to do Escalators. Mm. I'm nervous. I hope this lead works out for me. It's just such a good Pokemon to lead with. All right, so he's gonna. I'm gonna. It always does me first. Maybe it does the challenger first. That could be it, probably. All right, he's gonna send out Hottie. Who's that? What? I don't know what you'd be running. What are his Z Pokemon? Thunderous and Blazekin. Okay, so not gonna be this Pokemon. What would Mile run? Um, I'm afraid it's gonna be Choice Band. I'm gonna go for Knockoff here. I I think Knockoff's just a good play to hit anyone with just get rid of an item he's gonna set up his rocks oh of course okay what's he got shaka Ooh. Ooh. all right who even has earthquake atlas and tobin no tobin i gave still uh stone edge okay so let's see what do i want to do here i feel like i want to i want a thunderbolt actually I feel like Thunderbolting is just a good all-around play. It's the only thing it won't touch is the, the Flygon. And, I mean, I guess I don't have an Ice move. But I do have Ice Punch. I mean, you can get Ice Punch is what I mean. Sorry. Okay, he's going to withdraw. He's going to go into Shady's BFF. What a play. All right. Interesting. Now, obviously, you can't touch me with Earthquake. I'm gonna go for knockoff. Because I feel like you're gonna run. You're gonna be going with scarf. Or something. And getting rid of your scarf would leave you wide open. I mean, Escalators is straight up a problem. I love this Pokemon. Man, five kills in two deaths in, in two games. So this thing has been killing it for me. Like, straight up. Something I did not expect. He's gonna go for U-turn, so he knows I'm not switching. Okay, that's not banded damage. You can't be banded with that. So he might be scarfed. Obviously, I would not speed him, but he might be scarfed. Electro sadly does not have enough for everybody. So I mean, I've only revealed two moves, so he doesn't know I have Drain Punch, which I don't even need Drain Punch because he didn't bring uh, Crook. So oh, forgot Crook. That's why Giga Drain worked. I guess it doesn't matter anyway. Drain Punch is probably overall better in this situation because, well, G Giga Drain is weaker than Drain Punch, so yes. And this, is Drain Punch 60 or is it 70? I don't remember. But, Giga Drain's only 70. And it's special, and this thing is better physical attack. He's gonna go into Mandibuzz. Ooh, yay! Haha! <laughs> Get rid of your stupid leftovers. Now, I could go Thunderbolt here. And it's just the obvious play, but, um, he could go, he's probably going to go into Flygon. Is he? So he could go into Flygon, or, like, what could you even do to me? I'm going to go Knockoff. Good play. Good play. I expected him to swap, actually. I expected him to go, to double out into Flygon again. Now I'm a U-turn. Because now, I bet he's going to expect the T-Bolt. Uh, this thing could have definitely taken the T-Bolt, but uh, I definitely didn't want to have him switch. He's going to roost. Okay. 
That's fine. You were like, you literally lost maybe an eighth of your health. So we're gonna U-turn out of here. Oh, that's actually perfect. <laughs> Just that little bit extra damage. So basically that roost was wasted. All right, so what I wanna do here, um, I could go into Azura, which might be my best play. Or Rosbuton. Actually, Rosbuton has the Assault Best. It's not bulkier, though. It's bulkier especially, but physically they're about the same. Um, Tobin literally cannot touch... Actually, he can touch this thing with Stone Edge. So that could be decent. But straight up, Tailwind, uh, Terrakion just sweeps. So, that'll be nice to have. Um, let's see how much uh, Dazzling Gleam would do to a typical Mandibuzz. Okay, this will it'll do about half damage actually. That's not bad. And it oh my gosh, never mind. Uh, I don't want to do that because Manda was one shot, so foul play. I guess it does have really high base attack. Okay, so I'm gonna go into Rosbaton then. Because a dazzling gleam from this thing, it won't do as much damage provided, but it'll be better in the long run. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna go for the dazzling gleam. I want to see how much a Dazzling Gleam will do. Not bad. One more will take it out. He's going to go for Brave Bird. That will not kill unless you're like a, a physical... Are you... Or crit! Thanks. <sighs> okay. Whatever. What do I do? Alright, I'm going to go Azura. Azura outspeeds everything. This is my best bet. Um, there's no point doing anything rash. I'm gonna go for Dazzling Gleam. And if this thing stays in, it's dead. He can switch into whatever. Here comes Moil. The model's an issue because, one, I didn't expect it. Like, how do you expect it? That still did a lot, man. I'm gonna go for Thunderbolt, because you don't resist Thunderbolt, how much will Thunderbolt do? Okay, let's see how much this Thunderbolt will do. Oh my god! Okay. That's fine, I'm gonna go for freaking. I'm gonna go for Dazzling Gleam, I think. See, let's consider his team. I mean, Dazzling Gleam still did a lot to Moile, so I'm just gonna go for it. There's no point not doing it. Because it may straight up just kill the uh, Flygon if it's not like a Soul Vest. Okay. Now we learned its Choice Scarf. <sighs> I could go into Escalators here and put pressure on him again. Because he'll have to hard switch. Because he doesn't know what item I am, but he has to assume I'm Eel. He's seen my... Actually, he hasn't seen Drain Punch yet. Drain Punch would be my best move. Uh, if he goes... So I'm gonna go for Drain Punch, actually. Because if he goes into the Mandibuzz, that'll hit it hard. And I'll be the best play to go for. He's going into Moile. That'll hit... That'll actually hurt Moile pretty decently. Except for the Intimidate, so it's not gonna be that big of a deal. Okay, now we've seen my entire moveset. So I'm gonna go for Thunderbolt. And if you stay in and attack Escalators and I live, this thing is gonna go down with me. Need to write down what the fuck killed Flygon killed Azelf. And, and of course he brings the two Pokemon that I didn't prep for because they weren't updated yet. And they might have been in transactions, but they weren't on the actual roster, and that's where I looked. Because technically week two isn't even done yet. Hang in there, Escalators. Yay! That should kill. Oh, okay. Okay, we are in a good situation because I can bring in... Who's Clop Clop? I can't believe you said that. I'm going to cut that out. Okay! Um, I'm going to go for knockoff. It's gonna go straight for the horn leech, makes sense. Okay. Now, I could go on a Tobin here, I could also go into Atlas and obliterate this thing. 
think it's time for Atlas. I mean, there's no point not sending it out. Nothing wants to take this thing on. I outspeed everything except for the t the Tornadas or the Thunderous, and it can't kill me in one shot. So, we'll know if you're Choice Scarfed. You obviously will not stay in if you're Choice Scarfed. No, no, no. If you're Choice Scarfed, you will stay in. You won't... Are you Actually, I'm not even sure you'll one-shot Atlas, because Atlas is a beast. Um, but I'm pretty positive that Terrakion Poison Jab will obliterate this thing. Kebiberry. Hang in there. You know how different this would have been had I had Roserade to take this thing on? This thing would have been freaking dead. Because it couldn't have... It, I don't think it could have two-shot... I would have outsped. It couldn't one-shot me. So, that crit on Roserade made such a difference. And it's it sucks. I fucking hate Pokemon for that. I don't have Terrakion. I don't have Terrakion, so I lose. Freaking Vesuvius is good and all, but... If he's running Stone Edge over Earthquake, or if it even doesn't even get Earthquake... <clears throat> Let's see how much poison or sludge wave does. Let's still hit pretty hard. So obviously you're a special attacker, I'm gonna go for steam eruption. Doesn't even matter. I mean, I've lost. I've straight up lost. There's nothing I can do. Let's see if Tobin can bring this back. Hidden Power Ice, yeah. Great. Alright, well, we lose. So thanks so much for watching. Talk to you all. Later.